Matt Reeves' The Batman hints a potential team-up between the Riddler and the Joker at the climax of the film, but it's doomed to fail. So far The Batman has received a rousing critical acclaim, with much of Reeves' film's popularity owing to its radical new perspective on Gotham. The Batman's box office performance is another indication of its success, since it is the studio's highest-grossing feature since 2020. Despite the positive reviews for The Batman, the latest Batman film makes one misstep with its enemies. Paul Dano's Riddler is portrayed as a deliberate, calculating opponent who methodically plots out every piece of his strategy throughout the Batman. Except for the one element that wrecks his enjoyment human nature he has everything down to a science. He makes a disastrous error in comprehending Batman's nature, causing him to be imprisoned with another famous Batman villain. It's no secret that the laughing criminal that the Riddler chose to follow is none other than this universe's version of the Joker. The issue is that their criminal methods contrast much too much, especially with Dano's portrayal of the Riddler in mind. Not only that, but the Joker has a history of manipulating individuals like his Arkham neighbor, as well as a well-documented history of enmity between the two in DC Comics. All evidence shows that, while a team-up like this is appealing, it will not end well for either of them. The Clown Prince of Crime is known for being unexpected, and he exists to reflect crime's unpredictability. While the Joker has plans, few of them are as complex as the Riddlers in the Batman, therefore their approaches would clash. Joker, on the other hand, could be depending on it. The Joker is well known for his ability to deceive. Many of the people who've joined his gangs over the years are folks he's controlled as one of Gotham's greatest gang commanders in most continuity. The most notable character is Harley Quinn, who began her career in Arkham and was eventually seduced by the grinning gangster. If there's one thing the Batman has taught us about Riddler, it's that he's unstable, at least to the point where Joker wouldn't have any trouble winding the cunning serial murderer around his finger rather fast. The issue now is for what purpose he intends to employ Riddler. However, if Riddler notices, a problem may arise. He's at least smarter than most of the individuals Joker catches, which would almost surely lead to a rift between the two and make their team up a catastrophe from the start. Despite what the Batman stories of the 1960s portray, the Joker and the Riddler don't always get along. Almost as much as they are at Batman's neck, most Batman rogues, particularly those with their own gangs are at each other's throats. Most recently, there was Tom King's The War of Jokes and Riddles, which depicted a gang war between the Riddler and the Joker two years into Batman's vigilante career and ran from Batman Vol. 3 No. 25 to Batman Vol. 3 No. 32. Surprisingly, the Batman is set in the same time period, so it's completely plausible that Matt Reeves' Batman cinematic world is attempting to build up that plotline. Whatever the intention is for any sequels to the Batman, it appears that the Joker and the Riddler will be involved. While the film hinted at a possible relationship between the two, considering their canonical background, it is unlikely to work out. Because of Joker and Riddler's contrasting styles, Joker's proclivity for deception, and their recorded history of loathing for one another, it might end terribly. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.